often, um, and now they're just duking it out here in Raka. So here we are, Pokemon Stadium 2 ends castle. The charge shot is being oh. charged, but it was a fake. You just walked into my screw attack view. LOL! That is true. Like, once again, um, of course, the um, you can cancel the charging pretty fast and just go for a B. So I think that um, one of the key things in this matchup is also to fake out um, your neutral Bs. Oh, oh no! He's once at 1%! 1.7%! <laughs> I think he healed like 30% from that one. That was kind of crazy. Time to restart. Oh, you don't get to restart though, Muk. Only me! <laughs> Hit him up with an up B. Like, at the moment, I think that, uh, yeah, I, I think that he is going to be pretty up B happy for uh, the while that Q is being pretty aggressive towards him. So, yeah. There's been a little bit more use of the smaller charge yeah. shot because it can still combo into a dash attack or something else, and it's at least going to heal Ness less if, yeah. if it does happen. The yeah. full charge shots are going to be a bit of a rarity, but get up, get up attacking straight through the yo-yo setup. That was very quick reaction to just say, nope, I'm not having any of this. Hitting you now. <laughs> okay, gets a forward air into... Okay, it is uh, a getting uh, parried. Oh, getting the grab. Look at that. That was pretty good. He came uh, down with the uh, neutral B, faking him out, and then he hits him up oh, with a grab. Ooh. Does not kill with the neutral B, though. But with 190%, anything that uh, Samus does now will probably kill. And yeah, that was an interesting scenario at ledge as well, because Sa Whoa. Ooh, okay. Ness Look not only that. can absorb charge shot, can kill with up smash from below the ledge on the other side. On the right, there's a case of Ness showing you can also absorb Samus's down B, and that is like their main ledge trap, just gone at times. But you also have to be in close range to absorb it, so it still means Ness is going to be at the ledge. You can form a counter plan, just you might have healed them a bit first. Okay, well, that PK Fire getting blocked by the. Oh, by the platform, and now it is actually uh, two and two. That okay, one's going to do 30 flat. Oh, unfortunate. That was probably a uh, reverse aerial rush uh, back air, but yeah, he uh, actually did a forward air. But okay, let's see. He's still getting a grab, putting him uh, at the ledge right now, and now it's a natural situation. Well, apparently, um, you know, PK fire is a lot harder to hit with the charge shot, but Pew says, no, no, my turn. But now you got to get past the thunder. Ooh. Just hitting the PK Thunder to prevent it from creating a PK Rocket. We were so close to Ness rocketing off to the side and potentially taking a stock, but hitting the PK Thunder at the last part of possible second, that was excellent. Okay, and oh, he's, he still made it back. And that's a back throw. <laughs> yep. I was like, shouldn't you have been yo-yoing that scenario? Ah, whatever, just back throw. It's yeah, fine. Who cares? Like, you know, just, just shoot back throw. It's fine. Like, it's the easier thing anyway, so, uh, yeah. And okay. ka kaboom, there goes the charge shot. Fired into the abyss and now fired into the PSI magnet. Mug, a stock behind, so this is the last thing you want to see Mug bring me out. Oh, missing that forward air just by an inch would have been really good to get that last hit in and uh, put him off stage. But at the moment, I uh, just couldn't really get him to stay in disadvantage. Uh, Pew, pretty good at um, just kind of like avoiding all of those. Um, Let's trap situations, and that is honestly where Samus really shines. But he's really good at avoiding that. Yeah, but it's at ledge where he's going to get hit by the PK fire. Big danger for Muk. Pew, with the right move, could get things over and done with because Muk is quite happy to be at ledge to charge the charge shot, but that's also where you're more likely to die. This is something like a Nair combo. We're getting lots and lots of PK thunder. There's another attempt at hitting with the rocket. Oh, no. oh that will do it. And there it is. Okay. Alrighty, so uh, the first game actually going to Pew. I do have to say, like, okay. Of course, um, Ness has the tools to, uh, well, obviously win against uh, Samus, but I felt like this wasn't like necessarily a game that was super in favor of Pew. Like, Muck actually had like a lot of moments where he, um, where he actually had Pew, but I just feel like Pew just had more of them. He just had more moments where he could get his damage in. And once again, he avoided those ledge trap situations. Which once again, that is like the that's one of uh, Samus' strengths. And just the way that he could 
actually avoid it, but not only avoid it, and actually retaliate as well. Yeah, I mean, that makes it just very difficult. We'll see if anything changes in game two. The stage certainly won't. It's all about the game plan. Just don't charge shots straight into the magnet and you'll be in better form already. It's easier said than done. You can't just tell Samus, don't use your best move. Don't use your entire neutral. Yeah. But uh, at least you got screw attack. Oh, unfortunately, Here it is. is the uh, dash attack, but gets the up B though. Oh no, just staying in one place. Like, yeah, why not dash attack at that Sudo? That would have been an easy press of the shield button, but Muk putting so much priority on charging the charge shot that was just going to go into a magnet anyway. It's like, oh well, guess I should have just blocked the attack, huh? Getting a dash attack, putting him with disadvantage, missing the back. Uh, oh, okay, but um, but Muk actually finding back from the uh, from the left, throwing a uh, neutral beam, pretty good. Actually waiting out the spot dodge there for you, but didn't opt to do anything and just took a down tilt for the troubles. Uh, but also PK Fire stopping charge shot in its path. That's another thing that Ness can do to deal with Samus. If you don't want to reflect it, you can just stop it dead. Point blank it with a PK Fire. That could have been, honestly, a back throw oh. if you just waited for Muck to land, but instead keeping the combo going in a different way. Yeah, it is just, uh, it's just looking a bit difficult at the moment. Muck is just not really getting ooh, that one smash into oh, smash. well get uh, get more follow-ups. And at the moment, like you is at 68%, but I think in between like all of his absorbs, it could have maybe been at around 100. But he has just very well-timed absorbs and just keeps him, uh, which just keeps him in the game. Yep, so now it remains to be seen whether that 83% is going to go down or up. We don't want to write yeah, Muck off. Very good player and will be moving on to the top 48, irrespective of the outcome of this set. But you always want to stay in winners. It will make your life so much easier. I like it a lot that Zare is now being utilized in neutral. Muck is understanding that his neutral bees have been getting absorbed and that he's just not really getting as much mileage off of it as you probably want with Samus. So, utilizing Zare to actually make sure that you just push Ness away and that he actually cannot absorb that, it, it puts another layer on top of the whole mind game situation where um, he actually wants to throw out his neutral B and doesn't want to get it absorbed, but that kind of sucks. Yeah, like Ness having the... Reflector! <laughs> there it is! I was yep. gonna say it anyway! Reflector and the Absorber, that's one of the keys of the story, but also the yo-yo has perhaps been the single biggest asset. Just to closing out those stocks, there's been at least three yo-yo kills from Pew, be it the down smash or the up smash. You have the choice. Do you want the yo-yo to linger under the left ledge or the right ledge? Yeah. Because you have a smash attack oh. for both. They didn't know. Oh, oh my wow. goodness, wow. another... Oh, wow, another Absorber just right there. See, he's off stage and just healing off once again, like 20, 30 percent again. Yeah, it was a net profit. The up tilt just about didn't kill. Now the next one definitely won't. Well, maybe it will. We're back to 106. Um, we've seen, especially from Siski sets, just how early that move killed. People were not prepared for how strong that move is, but it's definitely unsafe to say the least. Mugs made a couple oh. of attempts that haven't worked. That grab didn't work either. Okay, so actually got himself off of the ledge, but it's just, this situation is just quite difficult. You have to like play at your A game to make sure that you uh, can still take this uh, take this game. I mean, Samus is pretty heavy, does have some good zoning and has some good damage, but yeah, how this, uh, with how this game has been going, like I just don't really know. For that. Yeah, Muck managing to oh. take a stock for that, so all it's it. gonna be a JV3. It's going to move Pew further into the winner's bracket where he's expected to